Hey guys, welcome to another grey day here. It has been raining all of yesterday and since this morning. So I'm going to cheer myself up with some pakoras because there's only one solution to rain, which is um, one thing to enjoy with the rain is the pakora and chai. So masala chai uh, recipe is already on the channel. I am sharing something very seasonal. So I have got some fresh little baby courgettes uh, because it, it, they are right now in season and I'm going to make courgette and red onion delicious lovely pakoras. So super simple, I've got a, um, I'm going to grate this quite uh, coarsely, not fine. And this is going to have some liquid in it, which is going to help with the batter. And I like to add some garlic to this because it's just garlic and it really needs to go into everything. I'm just going to finely grate this one. So um, courgettes are a bit, you know, soft and soggy and I've added um, the garlic for that lovely flavor and red onions are purely for the crunch. So I've just got one medium sized red onion and I'm going to thinly slice and add that. You obviously can add normal onion, you can add shallots, um, whatever you have at home, basically. You just want that lovely crunch. It doesn't matter uh, what uh, form of onion you are using. And this one's quite strong, so there it goes. Um, these are so, so simple. And while I'm mixing this, I've put some sunflower oil in a pan, in a kadhai. Um, and it's heating up. So as soon as this is ready, I can fry it straight without wasting any time. God, <laughs> right. Uh, not uh, much to add to this, just a little bit of uh, chili powder. So like half a teaspoon of chili powder, uh, half a teaspoon of salt. And I'm going to add gram flour. So next goes in some gram flour. So I've got, I'm just doing tablespoons so that it's easier for you guys. I'll tell you the weight of this as well. So I've got, um, God, I forgot how many tablespoons that was. I've got 70 grams of uh, gram flour and I'm just going to coat this very well. Where I said, because of the moisture in the courgettes, it's just going to start sticking quite straight away even before we add any water at all now it needs a bit more flour so i'm going to add some rice flour for the extra crunch also so this rice flour is just going to add lovely crispiness to um, the pakora so i've got 50 grams of this just going to mix it So what I'm trying to say is that it's not the kind of batter where it's, um, there, you know, there's more liquid and less vegetables. It's all about the vegetables and the batter is just there to kind of bring it together. Um, so as you can see, actually, I don't need any water whatsoever because that is going to be Plenty. I'm just going to add 10 more grams of the gram flour and that's should be all. If you just squash it, it will release more moisture and it doesn't need any water at all. Look at that. Right, time to fry this up. So there is so much moisture in here, come here, look at this, that it's gone all sticky. I haven't added a drop of water, I've just squashed it and it's released all the liquid. 
and that's the beauty of these pakoras um, if you want you can add chopped up green chilies um, it's never happened but unfortunately i haven't got any green chilies at all which is disaster disaster which is why i've added the red chilies anyways i'm taking a portion in my hand and i'm squashing it slightly or you can take smaller portions let's do smaller portions very very carefully take a small portion flatten it slightly and then put it straight in same portion flatten straight in i'm going to do this in a few batches and then once it's it's bubbling just turn the heat low because you don't want to cook it in 2 minutes you want to no you don't want to cook it in 2 seconds you want to take a few minutes to do this otherwise they won't be crispy once it's starting to get a bit golden just turn them over and you want to cook the other side as well of course Oh these are going to be so so good. And once they've cooked both sides all that's left to do is get them out on some kitchen roll and fry the rest of the lot. Look at those sizzling courgette beauties. and here they are courgette and red onion i can't wait <laughs> um onion pakoras look look at that the onions have softened mm 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 done Oh, it's good. Oh, you can taste the courgettes. You can taste gram flour. It's crispy with the rice flour. Ah, uh, you are. Mm. And you know how I'm gonna eat it, right? So I haven't got. I would normally serve this with a lovely coriander chutney. If you're looking for a coriander chutney. the next recipe i will share on my channel is a lovely coriander chutney so don't forget to subscribe and tune in this week if you if you click the ring uh, bell button then you get a notification every time i share a new recipe right i'm going to serve it because i haven't got a green chutney at home just some white bread um just making do with what i have at home some mayo and ketchup some pickles some sandwich and eat mm that is awesome mm i'm going to make some tea bye don't forget to subscribe